Hello everyone hope you all are good and this year AV Arvind speaking hope you all have a good day so in today's video we are going to see how to get more marks in KCET without studying without even seeing question paper by using probability trick with proof. <laughs> It's my responsibility to tell everyone about safety measures against the two new viruses named Delta virus and the newly arrived Zika virus and please follow the COVID-19 safety guideline. If COVID-19 is spreading in your community, stay safe by taking some simple precautions, such as physical distancing, wearing a mask, keeping rooms well ventilated, avoiding crowds, cleaning your hands and coughing into a bent elbow or tissue because your safety very important more than exam. And I want to thank you all for seeing my last video and many have commented in good way but some have commented that I'm misleading students and what I tell is not good. But I have clearly mentioned that video only for those WHO are dull in exam and having low confidence and you can use the trick only when you are in emergency situation in exam where you forget everything and try use inky pinky ponky trick. So that won't work instead of that you can use this option trick which I have mentioned in our last video. So let's see how to get more marks in KCET exam 2021 without studying. So hard work good or smart work good there always a big clash between these two terms. But when you're participating in a competitive exam along with hard work smart work very important. In KCET exam 40 percentage from first PUC and 60 percentage from second a PUC. As we all know the total marks for KCET for 180 marks. So according to KCET you have provided 1 minute for each questions which in terms means you have got 60 questions for 60 minutes. Which turns to be 60 minutes equal to 1 hour. KCET wants you to solve each question very faster in snap of seconds like Thanos. Yes probability trick valid for physics chemistry and maths. Now let's see how a probability trick works in maths in KCET 2021. This question's taken from KCET 2019 previous year question paper. So now you have to check which two options are almost similar either from starting or from and now second option and third option are similar from last both are having 600. So the answer might be between these two options. Then how to confirm which option may be correct from these two options, that can be done by taking the help of other two options then check the same type of numbers repeated in other options, now in this the numbers of second option are matching with with the fourth option for 30 percentage and matches with third option for 70 percentage, then the very important thing second option having both the similarities from option third and fourth, then therefore option second is correct. The given question if cos x sin x then, the general solution is? In this question you see that the first option and second option are similar from starting. Then the answer should be first option or second option. Then to decide which option is correct among first option and second option we take the help of other options. Here the fourth option supports the second option, therefore second option correct, and you can also verify your answer here. Then in this question the range of sec x's. In this question you have to find the answer pi comma zero or minus pi by two, so now you can see the fourth option having both the things, then answer will be fourth option, you can verify your answer. In this question you have the most common repeated terms are three and pi. And second option contains both 3 and pi therefore the answer will be the second option you can verify your answer here. In this question most common thing pi by 2, so the answer should be either plus pi by 2 or minus pi by 2. So after looking other options there is nowhere important terms for minus so plus wins, and therefore the answer will be fourth option. If you're solving without tricks then imagine how much you have to do so you can verify your answer here. In this question rd 3.5 mentioned, so chances of 3.5 being the answer very low, but the question gives you a hint that the answer will be an a decimal point, so if 3.5 not being the answer then option second that 4.5 will be the answer, you can verify your answer here. In this question the interval in which the function fx, 
x6 x2 plus 9 x plus 10 is increasing in. Here option 2nd and option 4th are same. Both are similar from starting, so now we have to find what type of bracket I is correct. For that see other options, in most of the option squared bracket used more commonly, so that the 4th option will be correct. You can verify your answer here. Read this question properly, in this question the word equations consists of 9 alphabets out of which 5 are vowels and 4 are consonants the question gives you as a hint at first they have mentioned vowel, here we have 5 vowels so the answer will be 5 by 9, you can verify your answer here. In this question option 3rd consists of both 2nd and 4th options so automatically option 3rd becomes the answer. If you're solving without tricks then imagine how much you have to do so you can verify your answer here. In this question option second consists of both first and third options so automatically option second becomes the answer. If you're solving without tricks then imagine how much you have to do so you can verify your answer here. In this question option 1 consists of numerator root 37 and option 3 consists of denominator root 10, so very important thing option 2nd consists roots for both the numerator and denominator, hence the answer will be 2nd option. If you're solving without tricks then imagine how much you have to do so you can verify your answer here. In this question option 4 will not be the answer because the probability of minus 1 not repeated in many options so option 4 will be eliminated. Then option 1 and 2 have a similar start, then among this the answer will be 1 comma 0 because 0 being mostly repeated in other options. So the answer will be option 2nd. If you're solving without tricks then imagine how much you have to do so you can verify your answer here. In this question you don't need to worry after seeing a big confusing options all you have to do that will be checking the symbols in options so here in options second and third are with same symbols. To decide the answer among this to options is by taking the help of other two options. The probability of greater than equal to symbol being more in other options so automatically the third option becomes correct. If you're solving without tricks then imagine how much you have to do so you can verify your answer here. Probability tricks for chemistry and physics are coming soon, if you learn little bit and use this trick these will be even more powerful. If you like the probability tricks if these were useful for you then do like, share and subscribe, and take care of your parents and yourself be safe and happy, and all the best for your exam thank you namaskara, Vanakam.